This presentation is on endoscopic excision of the electron spur. It's Greg Bain speaking. My co-author is Vikas Singh. The, uh, this work has been performed at Flinders University in Adelaide, Australia. We have no conflict of interest with regard to this presentation. A patient who presents with uh, electron on spur will typically describe having localised tenderness over the point of the electron on, and imaging will demonstrate that there is a sizable spur at the very proximal aspect of the electron on. This uh, CT scan nicely demonstrates this, but also the MRI scan, we can see that the, the spur is superficial to the triceps tendon, and there's an associated bursa uh, adjacent to the electron spur. At the time of surgery, we would advance a, a hypodermic needle into the area of the bursa and into the, um, the area of the spur to identify and confirm that this is where the spur is. At the time of introducing the hooded scope, we would then identify the needle and ensure that the area of the surgery is localised to the area of the spur. In this uh, video, we can see with the hooded scope elevating uh, the subcutaneous tissues, the burr is being used to resect the, uh, the spur and the adjacent bursa. So the advantage of this technique is it's minimally invasive. It avoids an incision over the electronon and we can see the final fluoroscopic image demonstrates that the electron spur has been removed. Following the surgery, the patient can then commence early mobilisation as there's no incision directly over the electron. 